Welcome to Exciting Machines. In today's video, we're taking you inside the fascinating world of Apple factories to see how the iPhone is made. From raw materials to the final product, discover the cutting edge technology and precision that goes into creating one of the world's most iconic devices. The manufacturing of iPhones inside Apple factories is a sophisticated process that reflects the company's commitment to precision, efficiency, and innovation. Apple maintains strict control over every aspect of its production line, from the sourcing of raw materials to the final assembly. While the design and development of the iPhone take place in Apple's headquarters in Cupertino, California, the physical manufacturing happens in multiple factories, with Foxconn, Pegatron, and Wistron being among the most significant manufacturing partners. These facilities, primarily located in China, are vast and equipped with state-of-the-art technology which allows Apple to produce millions of units each year. The journey of making an iPhone begins with raw material sourcing. Various rare earth minerals such as gold, silver, and palladium are required for the intricate internal components of an iPhone. Apple relies on a global supply chain to procure these materials, with many of them coming from mines in Africa, South America, and Asia. The raw materials are first refined and then sent to suppliers who produce components such as the circuit boards, microchips, and memory storage units. These components are manufactured to precise specifications, and Apple enforces stringent quality control measures to ensure that every part meets their high standards. Once the components are ready, they are shipped to Apple's assembly plants, the largest of which are run by Foxconn in cities like Zhengzhou, known as iPhone City. These factories are massive housing hundreds of thousands of workers who operate on assembly lines that span several kilometers. The assembly process is a blend of human labor and automation. Workers perform tasks like securing tiny screws and attaching delicate components, while advanced robotics handle tasks that require a level of precision beyond human capability. The process begins with the iPhone's logic board, which is essentially the brain of the device. This board contains the central processing unit, CPU, memory chips, and other crucial electronics. The logic board is manufactured by suppliers such as TSMC, Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, who fabricate the chips using cutting-edge photolithography techniques. These chips are then soldered onto the logic board, which is carefully inspected for defects. Following the logic board, the assembly line moves to the display. Apple uses high-resolution retina displays which are sourced from companies like LG and Samsung. These displays are made with meticulous attention to detail, ensuring that the pixels are aligned perfectly and the touch sensitivity is accurate. The display is attached to the iPhone's frame using advanced bonding techniques that create a seamless integration between the screen and the metal chassis. The next stage involves assembling the iPhone's casing. Apple has revolutionized the manufacturing of its aluminum and stainless steel cases by using a combination of precision machining, laser cutting, and anodizing. The raw aluminum is first cut into the general shape of the iPhone's body. Then, it undergoes a series of CNC, computer numerical control, machining processes that mill the case down to micrometer level accuracy. Once the machining is complete, the cases are polished and anodized to give them their characteristic color and finish. This process is highly automated, but requires careful oversight to ensure that the anodized finish is even and free from blemishes. After the case is ready, the various internal components are placed into the body of the iPhone. These include the camera module, battery, taptic engine, which provides haptic feedback, and speakers. Each of these components is sourced from specialized suppliers around the world. For example, the camera modules, which are one of the most complex parts of the iPhone, are often supplied by companies like Sony. These cameras undergo rigorous testing to ensure that they meet Apple's high standards for image quality and performance. The battery, which is lithium-ion, is supplied by companies like Samsung SDI and ATL, Amperex Technology Limited. The battery is carefully inserted into the iPhone and connected to the logic board. Apple uses advanced battery management software to ensure that the device charges efficiently and has a long lifespan. Throughout the assembly process, quality control is paramount. Apple uses a combination of human inspectors and automated systems to check for defects. 
Each iPhone is inspected at multiple stages to ensure that every component is functioning correctly. For example, once the camera is installed, it is tested to ensure that it focuses correctly and produces clear images. The logic board is also subjected to a series of tests to ensure that all the chips are functioning as intended. Any iPhone that does not pass these tests is immediately removed from the production line and either repaired or scrapped. Once the assembly of the iPhone is complete, the device undergoes a final round of testing, which includes software installation and functionality checks. Each iPhone is loaded with the latest version of iOS, Apple's proprietary operating system. The phone is then connected to diagnostic equipment that tests its various functions, including the touch screen, buttons, and sensors. This testing process is largely automated and allows Apple to check every aspect of the phone's functionality quickly and efficiently. After the final test, the iPhones are cleaned, packaged, and prepared for shipment. Apple's packaging process is also highly automated, with machines responsible for placing the phone into its box along with accessories like the charging cable and documentation. The boxes are then sealed and labeled for shipment to distribution centers around the world. Apple has a complex logistics network that ensures that iPhones are delivered to customers as quickly as possible. The company uses a combination of air and sea freight to ship the phones to different regions. And once the phones arrive at regional distribution centers, they are sent to retail stores and directly to customers who have pre-ordered the devices. The workers in Apple's assembly plants are a crucial part of the manufacturing process. Apple has come under scrutiny in the past for working conditions in these factories, particularly those operated by Foxconn. The company has made significant efforts to improve conditions for workers, including reducing working hours, increasing wages, and providing better living accommodations. Foxconn's factories in China have massive dormitories where workers live, as many of them come from rural areas and need housing near the factory. In recent years, Apple has also increased the use of automation in its factories, with robots handling more of the repetitive tasks like inserting screws or applying adhesives. However, human labor is still essential for many parts of the process, particularly those that require dexterity and attention to detail. Apple's manufacturing process is a testament to the company's ability to manage a complex global supply chain and produce devices at an unprecedented scale. The company's factories are a blend of cutting-edge technology and human labor, working together to create one of the most sought-after consumer products in the world. Each iPhone is the result of years of research and development, careful planning, and meticulous attention to detail. From the sourcing of raw materials to the final packaging, every step in the manufacturing process is designed to ensure that the iPhone meets Apple's high standards for quality and performance. This process is not only a reflection of Apple's commitment to innovation, but also its dedication to delivering products that its customers can rely on. Despite the automation and advanced technology involved, the human element remains a critical part of iPhone production. Apple's workforce and its partner factories works around the clock to meet the global demand for its products, which continues to grow year after year. Apple's focus on precision, efficiency, and innovation ensures that the company will remain a leader in the smartphone industry for years to come. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this deep dive into how iPhones are made inside Apple factories, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to Exciting Machines for more exciting content on the latest in tech, machines, and innovation. Stay tuned for more, and we'll see you in the next video.